Lesson Two. Number three, the microendoscopic technique, Akiyama method. The benefit of the surgical microscope is, of course, improvement of the treatment level. There is no doubt about it. Though we don't actually focus on the techniques when using the surgical microscope in the dental practice. For example, at the beginning, when base was first sprayed, we didn't think about the details or techniques. At that time, the most important thing was just to play and get used to the game itself. Thereafter, baseball has innovated the game's techniques, therefore the quality of the game has advanced dramatically. After the invention of the game, baseball has become world-renowned sports and it is one of the highest level sports played today. Even at an elementary school baseball level, we need high quality techniques in order to win the game. Every sport follows this same pattern. First, just find the game. Next, innovate new techniques. Finally, change the sports quality completely. Today I'm going to introduce my innovative surgical microscope techniques for the dental field. What is the quality of using the surgical microscope for treatment? There are two dentists who are both performing the same treatment with the same quality level, but one dentist performs the treatment faster. By this we can understand the who performs the treatment faster obviously has more advanced treatment skill. We have to think about the mirror view technique compared to the direct view technique. If we increase the use of direct view, we can then reduce the treatment time while increasing treatment quality, so it is important to increase direct view technique. I found a technique named the microendoscopic technique again method. This technique increases the use of the direct view when using the OPM epicomoral interface. So when using the microendoscopic technique, we can provide the patient with high quality treatment and we can greatly reduce the treatment time. This is a causeless OPM epico with more movement. This is a surgical microscope's maneuver. Modern baseball, right hitter, left hitter, right pitcher, left pitcher. I divided the modern surgical microscope techniques into three categories, maxillary mirror, mandibular mirror, the microendoscopic technique. I wrote an article. So, 2007, Nippon Dental Review, 2013, this is so cool. 2013 Dental Diamond. The technique of the surgical microscope has already moved on the next stage. The old technique mainly uses the 12 volt portion while mainly using the mirror technique. OPM Pico Moro interface completely changed the technique of the surgical microscope. My new technique mainly uses the direct view. The technique's name is the microendoscopic technique, Akema method. Why would we select the direct view or indirect view? If we can understand how we automatically can make such a decision. Then, we can implement this method of decision making for the surgical microscope. 
The ribs are the only obstacle in the way of the direct view. The ribs are easy to move. Here we can't move the obstacle for the direct view, so we have to use the mirror for the distal side second more teeth. Here we can't move the obstacle for the direct view, so we have to use the mirror for the distal side second more teeth. If we can move the obstacle, we selected the direct view. If we can't move the obstacle, we selected in direct view. We can see behind this mountain. The face of this mountain obviously obstructs the rear view of the mountain. So this is my research. This research considers the basic posture for when we use the surgical microscope. The surgical microscope is a huge device and difficult to maneuver. Therefore, we are forced to deposition this device at 12 o'clock and must use the mirror technique. The result shows that the construction of the surgical microscope makes for a new obstacle between the operator and the patient. This is the reason why the surgical microscope is so difficult to use in the daily practice. The introduction of a new obstacle changes the ratio of the direct view and indirect view when using the surgical microscope. When we use the surgical microscope, the ratio of the indirect view increases. So, treatment time increases and makes it very difficult to use the surgical microscope in our daily practice. So this is my research, comparing the treatment quality of the direct view and indirect view. The direct view uses a microendoscopic technique again method. The indirect view uses a general technique. I compare both techniques by performing the preparation of the ceramic crown for the upper front teeth. I use the conventional technique, the 12 o'clock position, and perform the preparation for the left upper incisor. Preparation time took 1407 seconds. The mirror technique took 675 seconds for a result of 48% mirror technique. Preparation for using the microendoscopic technique again method 10 o'clock position. Preparation time took 891 seconds for a result of 100% using the microendoscopic technique again method. Direct view. The conventional technique 23 minutes 27 seconds. The microendoscopic technique 14 minutes 51 seconds. So rubber side same quality, but parrot side, microendoscopic technique is obviously better quality than the conventional technique. When using the microendoscopic technique again method, we can use both hands during treatment, whereas the mirror technique. We must use one hand for the mirror, which only allows us to use one hand during treatment. So we can easily understand the microendoscopic technique again method improves the treatment quality. The construction of the surgical microscope makes for a new obstacle between the operator and the patient if the surgical microscope can move freely. This function can overcome this new obstacle. I use the microscope like an endoscope. Since I use it like an endoscope, I call this technique the microendoscopic technique again method. This technique allows the operator to change their position, which is in return increases the direct view treatment. Left side, this is a standard position. Right side, this is a microendoscopic techniques position.
This technique's purpose is to improve the treatment quality and reduce the treatment time. This is my research. I calculated the ratio between the direct view and the indirect view during my daily practice for 10 days. So result, the direct view is a 98%, mirror view is a only 2%. I was surprised because normally if we use a microendoscopic technique again method, the ratio of direct view is almost 70%. This research shows us that the ratio of the direct view will change depending on the dentist's microendoscopic technique the scale. If we use the direct view during treatment with a surgical microscope, we will reduce the treatment time and will improve the treatment quality. So I had a presentation at Carzais in 2012 we have to think about the correct technique when we use the surgical microscope due to the fact that the three techniques are quite different in the treatment time quality of treatment and difficulty level of positioning this is a microendoscopic technique again method please guess where I perform the tooth preparation Here, right lower wisdom tooth, this side. The construction of the surgical microscope makes for a new obstacle between the operator and the patient. This is the reason why the surgical microscope is so difficult to use in the daily practice. By using the flexible OPMI Picomoro interface, which moves like an endoscope, allows us to overcome this new obstacle. This technique's purpose is to improve the treatment quality and reduce the treatment time. The human being can't move like the Karzai's OPMI Pico with more surgical microscope. Same. If we can use the Karzai's OPMI with Mora maneuver, we can directly view various parts of the mouth and teeth. So if we use the Karzai's OPMI Pico Mora maneuver, we can directly view various parts of the mouth and teeth. By using the flexible OPMI Pico Mora interface, which moves like an endoscope, allows us to overcome this new obstacle. I will demonstrate to you how to overcome this obstacle. The surgical microscope's conventional technique. So this is a microendoscopic technique. So I will demonstrate the conventional technique to microendoscopic technique maxilla front teeth palate side this is a conventional technique mirror technique I will overcome the obstacle between the parent and the patient this is a microendoscopic technique position So next, the 12 o'clock conventional technique to microendoscopic technique, mandibular front teeth, ringer side. This is a conventional technique. I will overcome so new obstacle between the operator and the patient. So this is the microendoscopic technique again method positioning. The microendoscopic technique again method is very effective for dental treatment. We can reduce the treatment time and improve the treatment quality. This is my research. Compare the 12 o'clock position. The surgical microscope's conventional technique is normally set at the 12 o'clock position and the microendoscopic technique again method. 
I calculate the ratio of the direct view or indirect view on the teeth. I divide the tooth into nine parts. The microendoscopic technique direct view is 98.4%. The conventional technique is 38.1% direct view. So this is lesson two. Thank you for your kind attention.